according to the Russian Defense Ministry. In February 2022, the motorized rifle units of the Eastern Military District will receive new models of equipment. Accordingly, the infantry fighting vehicle BMP-1AM by Shumanin will replace the outdated BMP-1s. The modernization of the Soviet-made BMP-1 infantry fighting vehicle has been completed. The advantages of the new version BMP-1AM by Shumanin have been confirmed through state trials. After the Great Patriotic War, the Soviet Union still led the war in the production of tanks, but led behind Western countries in armor vehicles. However, instead of racing to mass-produce armor personnel carriers, the Soviet defense industrial complex developed a new type of vehicle that was responsible for rapidly transporting infantry units to the battlefield. The world's first infantry fighting vehicle, BMP-1, designed by Pavel Isakov, performed the same functions as an armor personnel carrier, but was better armed. The first prototype of the BMP-1 was built in 1966. The vehicle was 12.6 tons, 6.7 meters long, 2.9 meters wide, and 2 meters high. The crew of three includes commander, driver, and gunner, plus eight armed soldiers in the passenger compartment. From 1966 to 1983, the Soviet defense industry produced a total of about 20,000 vehicles. A large amount was exported to China, Mongolia, Middle East countries, Europe, and Africa. Currently, Soviet-made vehicles are in service with the Syrian army. In Russia, the BMP-1 is still active in service. According to experts, the most important part in the BMP-1 is the armor compartment. If not physically damaged, it can serve at least 50 years. As a result, with the relatively modest cost to upgrade, the army has a highly effective combat vehicles. The BMP-1AM version is considered one of the best options for upgrading the BMP-1. The BMP-1AM was first shown in 2018. In the same year, Iran Vagon Zavod announced the development of a large-scale modernization program for the existing BMP-1 fleet to the BMP-1AM level. According to the open sources, the units and formations of the Russian army have several hundreds BMP-1s, and several thousand more are in storage. The BMP-1AM was called the budget replacement for the BMP-3 infantry fighting vigor. The outdated 73mm gun Thunder, which no longer meets modern requirements for combating NATO military equipment, is being replaced by new weapons. The vehicle receives a unified fighting compartment from the BTR-82A with a 30mm 2A72 automatic cannon, a 7.62mm PKTM machine gun. The BMP is equipped with a fire control system with a combined oriented anti-aircraft side TKN4GA01, a two-plane weapon stabilizer and anti-tank guided weapons 
ATGM 9K115 Medis. The basic UTD20 engine has been replaced by economical UTD20S1 with the same 300 horsepower. The total weight increases to 14.2 tons, but the maximum road speed and the range remain the same. BMP1AM is now equal in firepower to BTR82A and BMP2. The modern combat module provides a better view for the commander and pointer. The fire controls with the night nice sight ensure precision fire. The maximum elevation angle increased to 74 degrees and the vehicle can fire at ground and air targets and effectively operate in urban combat when it is necessary to fire at top floors. Medis 9K115 anti-tank missile system is used to fight armor targets. According to the Russian Defense Ministry, in February 2022, the BPM-1AM Basermanin will be assigned to motorized rifle units in the armor region. The exact number of these new infantry fighting vehicles has yet to be determined, but is expected to be very large. In addition, steps to modernize the entire fleet of infantry fighting vehicles are being planned.